The drinks that is going around was the drinks that were given to our ancestors. If you don't drink, you are surviving on the ground. It is good to serve them drinks. It is good to serve them drinks. Uh, we are gathered here to officially Christian youth, when you are given birth, they give you a name. And now that the Almighty has united you and the family, it behoves on them to give you traditional names so you associate well with them. It is for this purpose we are gathered here. So that when you are given that name and you go out, you tell them, this is my name. I am from this clan. I am from this family. This is my clan house. Blah, blah, blah. On that note, we will call the names uh, in order of elders. The name that is now called Kwame Akio. Nana Kwame Akio. It will be so funny to see He will be called
Thank you. Thank you. Can you tell me your new Ghanaian name? Nana Kwame Otopa. Nice one, nice one. So, how do you feel about your new identity and you being the newest member of this family? I mean, I feel good. I'm, uh, my mission for the naming ceremony and everything was to restore what was taken from this area, Africa, Ghana, my ancestral roots to restore them back to where they came from. So I, I feel different. I feel different. So how often do you think that we will see you on this soil? I can say about once a year uh, at this point. Um, I'm 46 years old. Um, what I do back in the United States, I'll retire in about nine years. Uh, realistically, after that retirement, it probably won't be until I'm about 62 that I can move here 50% of the time because I still have young children. Um, but as I come back and visit, uh, this is my first visit, uh, anticipate making more visits and lengthening those visits out. And then once I do that, we'll make a permanent decision on what area we'll live in here. So that's, that is my goal. All right. All right.